the wiki files questionable actions of the secret service during 9 11 hello interweb a massive disinformation campaign has come against wikileaks in these last several weeks mainstream media and even members of the alternative media are being manipulated into disinforming the public about the importance of the contents and information on wikileaks this topic will cover but a small part of the information disclosed about the events of 9-11 by WikiLeaks. The full documentation spans many thousands of lines. So your help is needed in analyzing the information because the mainstream media refuses to address the issue. The log files entitled 9-11 messages hosted on WikiLeaks is a transcript including timestamps, IP addresses, phone numbers, names, email addresses, and large fragments of conversation over digital telecommunications networks. The log file spans the entire 48 hours between September 11, 2001 and September 12, 2001, capturing all an encoded digital communication sent in a USA. Through analysis, the messages can be pieced together to form full conversations, and some can even be pieced together to find the emails and names of those whom sent the messages. Upon preliminary analysis, a couple communication lines have been identified of those used by the Secret Service. The messages reveal that members of the Secret Services were ordered to not enter NYC and agents embedded in the city were led through several meeting points. At one point they were ordered to evacuate Stuyvesant High School, in the words of command, by any means necessary. Towards the end of the day, the Secret Service was ordered to meet at Chelsea Pier to board a ferry to depart NYC. This just in itself raises several questions. Firstly, what were SS agents doing in New York, and why weren't they ever made aware of there being a terrorist threat? Secondly, why were they ordered to leave the city, instead of staying planted to investigate? Thirdly, who, or what was it at Stuyvesant High School, whom were so important it had to be evacuated, by any means necessary? Why were SS agents ordered to stay home on September 12th? And lastly, what was the purpose of boarding a ferry, where was its destination, and who exactly other than the SS were on board? This is only a tiny fraction of a large amount of relevant and secretive information contained in the documents. This data can be correlated to many of the facts of the 9-11 cover, up we have already discovered. By using this data, a minute-by-minute -minute analysis of the events of the day in detail, including communications between important players on the subject, can easily be created. Thus, we will finally have a full and detailed picture of the true events of September 11th, along with the evidence to take those responsible to court for a long overdue prosecution. Due to the complexity of the data, including many timestamps, unconventional terminologies, and computer codes, we will need people of technical inclination to fully analyze the meaning of aspects of the data to piece it together precisely. Please also be warned NSA agents such as Wayne Madsen have been given agendas to manipulate the 9-11 truth movement against WikiLeaks. This has been done with complete lies and misinformation. His goal is to keep the truthers away from the information which could finally, absolutely, without a doubt, prove the conspiracy behind the events of that day. Please remember his former employer is one of those responsible for 9-11, and possibly him as well. Please support freedom of speech, and those whom stand on its side. At this climax point it will be individuals who make the difference, not the systems we've come to depend on which have only been used to abuse and disinform us. In this new world, it has yet to be decided who the leaders will be. Rich and powerful executives, aristocracies, and fascist factions have been intending to make the new world their own personal playground. It's time to demonstrate to them that it is in fact us the people who will inherit the new world and that we're not going to let them fuck it up anymore. Please join the cause, we are already over 9,000, please feel free to redistribute this video, by any means necessary. The previous video has been an unpaid public service announcement, brought to you by Anonymous. We are Legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget.